hello friends and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Brittany and I am so thankful you're here. Today I'm going to show you my room, a little room tour of my room here in Australia. I just moved last week so I think I'm mostly, well I'm pretty settled in and my, the room is mostly the way I want it. So I'm just going to give a brief tour of it. I am uh, sharing this with my boyfriend so it's not all my stuff but I will but I'll kind of I'll kind of cover both, mostly my stuff, obviously. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna enter from the outside. All right, so carpeted floor, very white, very white walls. Let's do a first impression. So yeah, pretty white walls. It's not um, big or small. Um, very very large windows and nice blinds as well so we'll start here on the right side so this is technically my dresser um, just has some of my stuff in there we have a salt lamp that we just got and a mirror there's there's me um, we really want to get a uh, essential oil diffuser um, for to you know to keep things smelling nice so I have I have an essential oil in here so this first drawer it looks like a mess it's fine um, this is just like where I plan on us keeping like house stuff or things that we would like need together like tape to tape stuff want to hang this up miscellaneous and then this is just like my drawer of stuff the bottom drawer is actually empty I normally keep my um, laptop in there um, extension cords. So I want to say something about the extension cords. My biggest uh, issue with the room is there's only one outlet and it's it's back here and there's only one like this whole room there's only one outlet and um, I think there's only one plug in the outlet as well. So we have a couple of extension cords and a power strip and I like basically has to service the whole room from this from this corner. So that's why we have this is so like this is an extension cord and this is a multi-power outlet, and I we might need another one once we get the um, once we get the diffuser, and yeah, oh, and this this thing turns on and off. I taped I taped that, so it's like really handy. All right, moving on. So this room actually didn't look like this at all when Gab and I arrived. Um, we arranged it so that there would be this big, big open space in the middle versus like medium or small open spaces throughout. I, I think it's so much better. I just, I like, we just pushed everything to the corners, um, especially the bed. So the bed was like, the bed was over here, like the head of the bed was over here. So it like jutted out right here and there's like a little, like little pockets of space. But when the bed is over there in that corner, I just have like more, just more access, more easy, just, just better better for me and it's better to walk around and then we also had there are actually two of these I broke down the other one because I didn't bring that much stuff um, we didn't have enough stuff to fill two of these cheapo armoires or whatever whatever these are so this is where I keep the the bags and um, just bags my hands free umbrella um, more of Gab stuff he actually brought more clothes than me which any, which I guess it's it's I think that's cool for me knowing that I have less stuff than my boyfriend um, but you know I do have to do my laundry more often and I'll probably have to replace my clothes more often because I'm wearing them more but that's okay I, I kind of like shopping this bottom thing is going to be like our workout stuff like there's my exercise mat that I bought at TK Maxx not TJ Maxx TK Maxx this is Gab's workout bag and this is my workout bag um, with my T-Rex band, shoes and gloves. All right, and then this other other side of it, this is where we keep our like dressy stuff or our like coats and jackets. And at the bottom, that is his suitcase with both of my carry-ons inside. It's like um, a Russian doll. You know, those Russian doll things where you put one doll on the other. That's what our luggage is like. This is a dresser and that is just a drawer set. Um, up here, I keep my miscellaneous items, the items that I use every day, frequently, and multiple times a day. So they're easy for me to grab like my bag, my notebook, my headphones, like they're right there so I can grab them whenever I want. 
And this, this drawers are also my frequently used items, but I don't grab them multiple times a day. I only grab them once a day. For example, my wallet. I actually don't use my wallet. I just take whatever I need out of it. My water bottle. Um, this is a selfie ring light, notebook, etc. And this is my daily, I guess my daily getting ready drawer. I share a bathroom with another couple. So I wanna keep some of my like essential items here in case the bathroom is occupied. I can still come here and grab, for instance, my deodorant or my contact cases or my hairbrush. This is my hairbrush. Doesn't it look like an Easter egg? And it's like, it's white, it has like holographic glitter on it. I love it. All of my clothes are in here. For example, this is all my workout stuff. I like to fold them or fold and roll them. There's my shoes. And so this is just like it just like a little kickstand for the window and you oops, you bring it in or you bring it out like that. Quite nice, quite nice. Oh, and then there's this random chair. Um, sometimes I sit in it, sometimes we hang our clothes on there to let them dry a little bit more, stuff our backpacks on there. Yeah, back to where we started. All right, so thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it was kind of interesting or at least informative. I know some of my friends and family are curious about my life here in Australia. So here's an update. Um, I know it's like so, it's so plain, um, but it's okay, it works. I love that the walls are white uh, and the window is um, facing the east. We have very good lighting, um, wonderful to wake up to. And yeah, this is, this is, this is my room, this is where I live. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll be making more videos about my life in Australia. So be sure to check back. If you like this, please like it. If you have anything to add or questions or whatever, go ahead and leave a comment, I will respond. And if you want to be updated on my life in Australia, go ahead and subscribe. Other than that, thank you so much for watching. I'm so thankful that you're here and I want to wish you a happier, healthier and more magical day.